everybody. Hope you are having a great Sunday afternoon. Thanks for being with us right here on NECN. I'm Caitlin Flint. We're happy to have you spending some of your Sunday with us. It is the last day of July, believe it or not. So we want to start with the top stories that we're following. We'll start with this one. So residents of this rooming house in Quincy, Massachusetts, they have no place to stay now because of a morning fire that broke out around 3 o'clock in the morning. Now, one woman even climbing out of a window to escape those flames. Thankfully, though, nobody was hurt here, but about 14 people are now looking for a place to stay. The death toll in Kentucky continues growing after historic flooding in that region. We're now learning more than two dozen people are dead, and officials say it's really unclear just how many people are missing because of how dangerous conditions still are. President Biden, meanwhile, ordering federal aid sent to that area affected by the storms. And the Mega Millions mystery continues. We do know one lucky person has that winning billion-dollar ticket. What we don't know is who that person is. So how is the last day of July going to be for all of us trying to head outside? Let's check in with meteorologist David Bagley to give us the details.